Congratulations, uh, Mitchell. Definitely happy with your performance and, and something that you've been waiting to getting out there and get the opportunity to making inroads into the Bangladesh lineup. Your thoughts? Yeah, yeah, it was definitely nice to um, obviously get the nod to play and um, yeah, some nice conditions to bowl on. Um, haven't really experienced anything like that back home, so um, definitely had a lot of fun out there bowling on that. Um, and yeah, hopefully uh, can get another go the next game. I'm sure Matthew Wade is listening to that and I'm sure the management as well. But just to talk us through that wicket, that ball that got uh, Mahmudullah, the quicker one and then the one turning away to Nurullah Glenn, your thoughts on the variations that you showcased out there? Yeah, well, I think um, on a wicket like this that was turning so much, um, I actually found it hard to get the ball to go straight. Um, so I had to use my pace, changes of pace, and then obviously use my wrong and well and um, just try and be accurate with it and hit, hit the stumps, basically. And I was um, lucky enough to do that tonight. We saw a hat-trick yesterday from Nathan Ellis. Uh, you were also on a hat-trick the very next over. How was your mindset for the next six deliveries till the time the ball came back to you? <laughs> if I'm completely honest, I actually completely forgot I was on a hat-trick. Um, <laughs> so that was probably my bad. In, in hindsight, though, it was probably a good ball for a hat-trick ball, but um, he got some bat on it. It was hitting the stump, so that's pretty much all you can do for a hat-trick ball. Doesn't matter. It was a splendid performance and an excellent outing for you. Congratulations on your award.